a call to action from the European Union's foreign policy chief. Joseph Burrell urging all parties to accept a new draft agreement of the Iranian nuclear deal or risk a dangerous crisis. After 15 months of intense constructive negotiations in Vienna and countless interactions with the JCPOA participants and the U.S., I have concluded that the space for additional significant compromises has been exhausted. Acknowledging it's not a perfect deal, he argues it's the best way forward for global non-proliferation, also urging acceptance from Tehran saying postponing an agreement postpones real economic benefits to the Iranian people through substantial sanctions lifting. The call comes after Iran on Monday warned it would not be rushed into a, quote, quick deal. Tehran confirmed it had received the new proposal. The coordinator has shared his ideas to conclude the negotiations. We, too, have our own ideas, both in substance and form, to conclude the negotiations which would be shared. The supposed final draft text comes after months of painstaking negotiations between Iran, world powers, and indirect participation from the United States. It's being framed as the last chance to save the 2015 nuclear deal that's been faltering since former U.S. President Donald Trump withdrew in 2018. Since then, Iran has ratcheted up nuclear activity, limited IAEA monitoring, and failed to fully cooperate with the Atomic Agency. Should diplomacy fail, some are already bracing for a plan B. Iran Iran is a global problem. It's not just Israel's private problem. We are able to seriously harm and delay the nuclear program. We are very unsatisfied with the agreement. Declaring the Trump-led and Israeli-endorsed campaign of maximum pressure a failure, the EU is once again urging the only way to reverse course and avoid a nuclear crisis is for all parties to sign the deal.